Om Namah Shivaya students. Hope you all are in good health. Today we will discuss about the basis of accounting. As we know, we do accounting to know the uh, profit and loss of the business by preparing profit and loss account at the end of the accounting period. Now, there are two basis of accounting, cash basis of accounting and accrual basis of accounting. And now we will discuss these two, two basis of accounting in details. What is cash basis of accounting? As its name shows, this system is totally based on actual income received in the form of cash and actual cash paid in the form of expenses. So, profit is calculated by comparing actual cash received and actual cash paid. Profit or loss will be uh, excess of cash received over cash paid or vice versa. This system is generally used by lawyers, doctors and other professionals. So we can see only cash transactions are recorded and credit transactions are ignored till the cash is received paid for credit transactions. What are the advantages of this? It is very simple method. No adjustments are required. Estimates and personal judgments are not required in this system and suitable for those organizations where most of the transactions are done on cash basis. <clears throat> what are the disadvantages? Number, some disadvantages are correct profit and loss during a specified period cannot be calculated because of lack of adjustment related to outstanding expenses, prepaid expenses, accrued income unearned income during a specified period then number two is matching principle can't be followed number three is lack of consistency in the profit or loss of the different years due to no distinction between capital and revenue items and last is this matter is not recognized by the companies at 1956 now what is accrual basis of accounting on accrual basis of accounting, we record all the transactions at the time when they take place and not necessarily at the time the settlement take place. This system of accounting is based on two basic accounting concepts that is revenue recognition concept and matching concept. Under revenue recognition concept, all revenues are recorded at the time when sales are made or services are rendered and not at the time actual cash is received and under matching concept all revenues of a particular period are matched with that period of expenses. It means expenses are recognized with the revenue associated with that particular period that is the reason on the accrual basis of accounting we take care of outstanding expenses prepaid expenses, accrued income and earned earn income to know the actual expenses and revenue of a particular period and further to know the exact profit and loss of a particular period. So profit and loss of a particular period is ascertained by comparing total income earned with that of total expenses incurred during that particular period. Now what are the advantages of uh, accrual basis of accounting? Number one is due to scientific approach this matter is preferred by the accountants. Second is accurate, uh, accurate uh, profit or loss can be calculated during a particular period because all adjustments are done related to outstanding and prepaid expenses and all accrued and earned, unearned income. Number three is Companies Act 1956 recognizes this matter. So it is systematic. Number four is consistency can be maintained in the profits of different years due to distinction between capital and revenue items. Number fifth is matching principle is followed. What are the disadvantages? This system is a complex system as compared to cash system due to adjustment. It requires use of personal judgments and estimates due to which Personal bias may affect profit and loss of a concern. And number third point is due to many adjustments, we follow an elaborate process to ascertain the true financial picture of a business. 
so a quick view of profit and loss cannot be made hope students all these points are clear to you wait for the next video till then goodbye om namah shivaya